that increase in surface area is the problem because when the car is you know, asked to deploy the airbags because of the impact sensors and, and the airbag module say, yep, I got enough of the data that says we got to deploy, they deploy. And they are supposed to deploy at a, at a birth rate that creates the airbag to be a cushion that is, once again, inflating while deflating. The problem we have here is with this corrosion, and the corrosion keeps on getting incorporated over time, and so that's why Betty said, as you know, eight years after we had five fatalities, this problem doesn't get better tomorrow. It just keeps on getting worse. The more moisture that gets inside one of the inflators, the more that corrosion takes place, the more that we can no longer control the burn rate of the inflator, and the metal container that it's in cannot hold that pyro <laughs> explosion and it, it rips apart and throws trash. So this Montcobra explosion, it didn't help the process because once again, when those environmental factors were removed from the assembly process, they started incorporating moisture in, as, as humidity into the production process and started off a little bit quicker. Hence why we had all the um, uh, lacerations and fatalities in these L cars. So that's kind of the, that's kind of behind the scenes of how we got here. Um, obviously, daily, every single day, I wake up and the first thing I do is look at the ten campaigns and how they're trending. And over time, you know, this line has trended down. We had we had one month in October of 2017. This was one month now that we repaired 250,000 inflators. Um, now in a month we're doing 